Hi Libra, welcome to your weekly reading for November 29th. Let's see a beautiful reading for Libra. What do you guys need to know, hear, or see? Um, I hope everyone's doing awesome today. Here's your first card. Queen of Cups in the upright. Okay, so this is beautiful start. You are, you could be giving your love to someone. You're caring about something. You could be feeling very psychic right now. You're in tune with your emotions. This is a very happy and in love card. Very motherly card. You could be caring for someone in the how. Ace of Cups in the upright. You are putting your feelings on the table. You're telling someone how you feel. You're being very honest. You're being very open. You're feeling very hopeful. Well, this is a great start. Two cups of love. In your why? Oh, well, that was a surprise. The devil. In the why, you have the devil in the upright. <clears throat> Excuse me. This could be something that you're very, you could be very strongly attracted to someone. You could like what they have materially. They could be very good looking. You could be feeling captivated by someone. This could be a Capricorn. You're feeling very, very much in love. You want to help this person. You might want to help heal this person. You could be married to this person. This can be um, about bonds, bondage. So there are strings attached. Let's see how you're going to feel about it. Ace of coins in the upright. Wow, two aces, Libra. Um, you feel like there's gonna be a payoff in the end. You're feeling very in control, very content, very abundant, very blessed. This is going to pay off for you. This might not be a person. You have the devil with an ace on either side <clears throat> Excuse me. So something beginning, something new. Something's got you weak in the knees for sure. I'm trying to see if this is... Um, this could be work-related. This could be you giving your all to a job to get the material things that you want. You're perfectly happy working like this. You know it's going to pay off in the end. You could be trying to change something. Let's see what your advice is. Another ace. Ace of swords in the reverse, which is the good way. You're changing your mind about something and it's going to pay off. This is speaking your truth. This is fighting for what's right. This is speaking up. You could be... Hmm. You could be confronting something. Um, you could be confronting a Capricorn, but you're doing it with love and with fairness and with full confidence. You might be worried that it's not going to be taken well. 
So don't, don't be too abrupt. Speak your truth. You might be trying to change someone's mind. They might need to see facts. You might need to show someone, this could be a job, this could be a person. Um, you're trying to change someone's mind and you need to do it gently. But you need to show them facts. They're not moved by emotions. They might not even be moved by your um, how much you care about them. But facts. They need facts. Bottom of the deck. Four of coins in the reverse. This person is closed off. They're closed off. It's like, um, to me, fours are, they're like, um, it's like a fortress. In, it's like, um, it's something impenetrable. It's like they've closed the subject. They've closed off their heart. They've closed off their happiness and they're happy in this restricted mind frame. So the only way, if you're trying to change someone's mind about something, you're going to have to give them concrete facts. And I'm going to end it there because I just heard someone pull in my driveway, so I'm about to get interrupted. So that was your reading for this week, Libra, and I hope that helped. Your shuffle song is called Band of Matron Saints, and it's by RJD2. All right, I love you guys. Have a great week. Bye.